what, what I like about your podcast is that it's a very uh, you, you you listen to your music and you analyze it to some extent, but on, on a very sort of human level, you know, it's it's about your appreciation for a tune. There's a tendency I've noticed in a lot of of people who do analysis of songs into is to rely too much on the technique behind it or you know the the musical arrangements or analyzing it it just becomes musical mathematics after a while mm-hmm. and i think that's actually detrimental to your appreciation of music music is is not about the the theory behind it now you can argue that you know those composers have very intricate theory and that kind of stuff but in for a lot of them you will find that it just happens because they are that good and they are that you know naturally gifted at composing they didn't actually sit yeah. down and and did the maths and you know to to compose something they didn't sit down and go okay i need uh, this arrangement and then here because this emotion is generated by the fifth sustain whatever it's, it's not how people <laughs> compose it just isn't it is how yeah. you compose when you're in college and learning about music theory but it's it's not afterwards how you compose at all so it's um yeah i've seen a lot of channels just analyzing and, and i think it it kills music that sort of music maths and uh, that's applied to every every tune that you love like, like there's a reason why it's it's good and evocative and it's it's not mathematics <laughs> yeah uh, you're absolutely so you, you right you can explain it that way but it's only one way to explain it and i think it's sort of the easy way everybody can do you know uh, mathematics to some extent but 